Hello. In this series of four short videos, we're going, I'm going to describe a Taylor series for approximating a function and show how these are used in numerical analysis to find approximations and to estimate their accuracy and their order of accuracy. There are some notes, uh, these notes, which you can download and fill in as we go along. Um, alternatively, you can work through the notes without the videos. So a Taylor series is a polynomial, um, and an, an inf infinite polynomial, and many functions can be expressed as Taylor series. So for example, this here's an exponential function. We're going to find a Taylor series that approximates this exponential close to x equals 0. So we'll start off by just putting in x equals 1, which is close to the exponential, very close to uh, x equals 0. Uh, and next we put in 1 plus x, which is closer, closer for uh, a larger region close to x equals 1, and so on. We'll add in more terms until it's getting closer and closer to the, um, uh, to the real exponential. Um, and so it's closest here where we're f um, finding the values of the polynomial. And as you get further away, it gets further, the polynomial gets further from the exponential. But the more terms you add in, the closer it gets. We can do the same with a sine wave. The first term of the polynomial we'll put in is x. So again, it's very close at the centre here, and it gets further away as the sine wave um, starts to oscillate. Add in another term, and another, and another. It's getting closer and closer, and it's getting closer further away from the centre of the Taylor series. The more terms you include, the more accurate it will get. Um, not all functions can be expressed as Taylor series. Uh, for example, a square wave, as a polynomial, cannot jump between 1 and minus 1. Functions with discontinuities in, the, in some of their derivatives cannot be expressed as Taylor series. So, for example, this cosine Bell function, which is this cosine function for a magnitude of, of x less than pi and 0 otherwise. It can be expressed, expressed as a Taylor series in this part here, where all the derivatives are continuous, but out here it can't because a polynomial can't be uniform in one place and non-uniform in another. So a ta what is a Taylor series? Which functions can be represented as a Taylor series? Uh, a Taylor series is always expressed about a position, we'll call it A. So the function must be continuous near A. All of its derivatives must be continuous near A. Then if we use the notation uh, delta x equals x minus a, where a is the centre of the Taylor series and x is the position at which we're find, trying to find f close to a. So the Taylor series for f at position x, which is close to a, is, well, first of all, we use f of a, and then delta x times the gradient of f at a, and then the second derivative times delta x squared over 2 factorial, and so on. Uh, infinitely many terms. I'm using the not notation here that f primed of s is the, the gradient, f double primed is the second derivative. So if, if infinitely many terms are used, then this is approximation is exact near a. If all terms of order n and above are discarded, then the error is approximately proportional to delta x to the power n, if delta x is small. Then the approximation is nth order accurate. So, for example, if this term is discarded and all the rest of the terms are discarded, this term is much bigger than all the other terms because delta x cubed is much bigger than delta x to the 4 and delta x to the 5 and so on because delta x is so small. So this whole error is approximately proportional to delta x cubed. So a third order accurate approximation for f of x has error proportional to delta x cubed and we write it like this. It's got the first three terms and then the error written order delta x cubed. Uh, if delta x is small, then generally higher order, higher order accuracy, accuracy means higher accuracy. So now some exercises, um, just writing out some Taylor series for um, different uh, values, and the answers are at the end of this worksheet. <laughs> 